This is a special uh, Brazilian Grand Prix for you. 10 years in Formula One, 100 races with Ferrari. What is your feeling uh, going to Interlagos? Well, it's fantastic, you know, to do 10 years in Formula One and uh, 100 um, races for Ferrari. Uh, so it's, uh, it's a special uh, weekend. I hope we can have a, a very great result at the end of this race, you know, just to, to celebrate this import, important time for my career, for me, for the team as well, you know, because uh, I am maybe uh, one of the drivers who race more for Ferrari, you know, and uh, I think this is very important and I hope we can have a, a great weekend, great time together and a very nice result at the end to celebrate this uh, fantastic moment. So I'm still young, not very old for the moment, but uh, I think it's an important time, you know, on my career and on my life as well. Out of the 99 races already done with Ferrari, what is your best memory? I think the best memory is always the victories. Um, all of the victories I remember very well is fantastic. First victory in Turkey, all of the other victories. And um, I would say uh, the victory in Brazil, you know. The first one, uh, it was very, very special to win the first time at home, you know. Um, it was like a dream come true, you know. And um, I remember so so much all the Brazilian drivers which was always you know uh, you know pushing very hard to win at home remember Senna he took long time to win at home you know and when he won it was like uh, you know you know the the feeling was like to win a championship and this this was my feeling you know like uh, to win a championship so it was so special the first victory in Brazil and the bad time was the accident you know in Hungary when um, I had a difficult time for my life, you know, uh, I lost many races and uh, it was a big uh, risk, you know, for my life. But um, here we are and uh, we carry on uh, pushing hard to try to achieve even uh, all the great memories as well. And the win in uh, 2008 was a bit uh, sweet and sour. What do you remember? The win in 2008 was um, it was always very special because it was a, I did the pole position, the quickest lap, the, the victory, and uh, we almost won the championship in Brazil. So, you know, it, it was not uh, um, a race, it was not coming just from my side, it was coming from my, my you know, uh, my uh, competitors, you know, for the championship. So I did my best, but uh, we didn't lose the championship in Brazil, we lost before. And do you remember your very first time driving a Formula One Ferrari car? Remember so well. When it was? It was? A, it was a fantastic time. It was in Maranello. Uh, it was a 2002 Ferrari. So it was a world champion Ferrari. So uh, it was so great, you know, to drive uh, such an important uh, car like Ferrari. And um, coming from Sauber, which was a small team, and uh, I think it was so nice. The engine I knew very well because I always, I never drove another engine, which is very nice, you know. Uh, in Formula One, I, I never drove an engine, which it was not from Ferrari, so, but it was such a fantastic time. You lived in Maranello for a few times. What is your feeling about uh, that small town? It was uh, very nice to live there. I think Maranello is so special because everything is, uh, is depends and is around the Ferrari team and uh, makes the, the town very special. So, which I always enjoy to go to Maranello, uh, to be there, you know, to go to the restaurants around, uh, which is always, you know, on the family from, from the Ferrari. And, um, to work with all, everybody inside the, inside the team, everybody inside the team, not just Formula One, but also the, the road cars uh, uh, manufacturer, the company, everybody who works for the, for the brand, which is thousands of thousands of people. So it's very, very special, you know, Maranello, because of Ferrari. You are part of the Ferrari history. 
Are you proud of it? Very proud, because uh, Ferrari is the most important uh, team in Formula One and is the, is the most uh, dream brand for the, for the road cars. So I always dreamed to have a Ferrari in my garage, even when I was a kid, you know. And then when I was looking to a Ferrari on the road, it was like a dream come true. I'm, I'm, I'm looking for a Ferrari car, you know. And um, so that's why it's so special, you know, to be part of the, the Ferrari family, Ferrari brand, and uh, to complete uh, 100 Grand, Grand Prix for Ferrari and to be the, the one of the drivers who drove most for this, for this car. 10 years in Formula One, who are the most important people who were with you throughout uh, those years? Well, I think it's difficult to, to, uh, to say every name, you know. Uh, I have uh, so many, so many um, important people who help my career, um, who teach me a lot. So, starting from my father, you know, which was the, uh, the main um, uh, person who, who helped me, who teach me, uh, who, who, who showed me the direction to be, you know, uh, who educated me. But then a part of my father, my family, uh, my wife, uh, so many people, you know, so many people who, who helped me in sponsors direction, otherwise I would never arrive in Formula One. Um, so many people who helped me, uh, you know, to, to, to on, on every things I, I race, so many mechanics I worked during all my career and, uh, and everybody. So I think it's difficult to put names per names, but it's a lot of people which helps me a lot and uh, uh, without these people it would have been difficult to be where I am. You celebrate 10 years, but your friend uh, Michael Schumacher has uh, just celebrated 20 years in Formula One. Do you think you're gonna race uh, 10 years more? Uh, <laughs> not sure. I think uh, 10 years is a lot. I already doing 10 years is a, is a long career. Time goes by very quickly, but it's a long career already and uh, I think 10 years is, uh, is maybe a lot. Uh, I would say half of that, yes, but maybe 10 years, maybe not. Uh, let's come back to this year. Uh, it was not the best one uh, in your career. What is your spirit uh, thinking back to 2011, but most of all thinking towards 2012? Well, for sure, already thinking about these two races, I hope we can have a better result than we had all this championship, uh, but already working almost 100% on next year, you know, to have a, the championship we, we, we want. Uh, this year we, we didn't have the championship we expected, you know, um, but we're pushing hard to have next year, to be strong from the beginning to the end of the championship, to fight every race, for the victories, for the championship, and uh, and this is the, is the target for uh, from myself as a driver, but from the team as well, uh, to be uh, you know again fighting for the championship, which is what we want.